It's my spirit. Where you at, man? Baby. You here was in spirit. <laughs> we used the name. It was in great San one. Antonio. San Antonio. Home of the Alamo, baby. Home of the Alamo. What, and more what? importantly, the place where Dolomite was born. Dolomite. Dolomite was from right, San Antonio. Kick it. Kick that he was shit. a rambling, scrambling, gambling motherfucker from the day he was born. From the day he was dropped from his mammy's ass, he slapped his pappy space and said, Move over, cocksucker, for now on I'm running this place. From the age of one, he was drinking the whiskey and gin. And from the age of two, he was eating the bottles that came in. Now, Dolomite had an uncle called Sudden Death. Killed a dozen bad men with the smell of his breath. Dang. And when he heard how Dolomite was treating his mom pa, he said, let me go check this little bad rascal go before he go too far. It was one cold dark December night when his <laughs> uncle broke in on Dolomite. His uncle said, Dolomite, I want you to treat your mama right. And if you don't stop with this filthy mistreating, I'm going to whip your ass till your heart stop beating. Dolomite was sitting in the middle of the living room floor plane. Said, I see your lips quivering, Uncle, but I don't hear a cocksucking word you're saying. That <laughs> made his uncle mad, and he let off with a right that made lightning flash. But Dolomite tore his leg off. He was that damn fast. Thousands of men gathered around San Antonio that night to see what they could do about the little bad rascal called Dolomite. It took a hundred of the biggest, boldest, baddest motherfuckers in town to finally bring Dolomite's bad ass down. Last minute, they threw him in jail. They held him without bail. And now it's been 12 years since Dolomite has been fed. The average motherfucker would have long, long been dead. The warden brought him down and said, well, Dolomite, look at here. We're going to give you a dollar and a half and a damn good meal if you promise to leave us alone and get your bad ass out of San Antonio. Dolomite said, look at here, warden. I will take the dollar and a half and a damn good meal. But before I leave, I got to tell you how I feel. You can suck my dick, nuts, and ass down to the motherfucking bone. Because I ain't never coming back to San Antonio. And with that, Dolomite said, well, I think I'll go out west and try my fate. He got a job in Africa kicking lions in the ass to stay in shape. He got thrown out of South America for fucking steers. He fucked the she-elephant till she broke down in tears. Now, <laughs> Dolomite worked nine years in a day. Got his pay. Said, I think I'll go back to that jive-ass USA. When the news of the heavyweight fight was being broadcasted that night, and a special bulletin said, look out for storms, atomic bombs, and Dolomite. Well, the first thing Dolomite encountered was two big rocky mountains. Dolomite said, mountains, what y'all going to do? They said, we're going to part, Mr. Dolomite, and let your bad ass through. Went on down to Kansas City, kicking asses to both shoes with shitty. Hobo in the shy. Who did he run into with that two-gun Pete? Dolomite said, nigga, move over and let me pass for I make these stets and sing a song in your ass. I went on down to 42nd Street, not for no shit, just a place where he could sleep and eat, and ran into that shy ass Mabel. Of all the hoes, she was boss. She would suck you, fuck you, and jack you off. She said, well, hey, Mr. Dolomite, so I want you to come to my pad tonight. Said, we're going to fucking fight to broad daylight. Dolomite said, bitch, it's best you not fuck with me. Let me run down some of my pedigree. So I swam through bloody waters and they never got wet. Mountains just fell on me and I ain't dead yet. I fucked the she-elephant as dead as a mother. I could look up a bull's ass and tell you the price of butter. I swam across the ocean on the head of my dick and ate nine tons of cat shit and ain't never got sick. And you talking about wrapping your big hot juicy pussy all around my bad ass chin. Well, bitch, you ought to be blowing out my ass trying to be my motherfucking friend. But, oh, Mabel farted. And that's when the fucking started. She made a <laughs> pussy do the popcorn, the turkey, the mojo, and the grind. Left Dolomite's bad ass nine strokes behind. But suddenly, Dolomite made a mojo turn and had the crabs around her asshole hollering, burn, baby, burn. And the next day, they found Mabel dead. 
with her drawers wrapped around a nappy ass head. And the crabs was madder than a motherfucker. Cause Dolomite beat him out of the goddamn supper. Now Dolomite kept on kicking ass and fucking up in the fall till finally his role was called. Dolomite was dead, but his dick was still hard. That nigga's from San Antonio. Huss. Good night. <laughs> <laughs>